Shalom. Call Halal Yahweh, Ba Hashem Yahweh Shai, Ba Hashem Rakakwadash. Double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone who taught me this truth and rule well. Salutation and citations to the brothers out there that are laboring and pushing this truth in truth and in sincerity and in charity, risking their lives and their freedom to do so. To you, I say Shalom. To the Akiam and to the Akwath, that will be you, brothers and sisters. Adawan Rataza, that is to say, Lord willing. Hopefully, by the end of this lesson, you'll be edified. This is your brother Amawan Ibad from the GMS Miami camp. Back again with another lesson to the spread and power of Yahweh, Ba'ashim, Yahweh Shai, to feed the lambs of Yahweh, Yahweh Shai, as commanded. And this lesson is going to be entitled, Walk in the Light. All right? The title for this lesson is Walk in the Light. All right? And when I say walk in the light, all right, uh, I'm talking about our Lord Yahawashai. Okay? That's what the scriptures is talking about. All right? The Lord Yahawashai. All right? He's the light, man. Okay? He's our, he's our, he's our example. He's our model. He's the, uh, the shepherd of the flock. All right? He's the shepherd of the sheep. All right. Um, so, yeah, walk in the light. All right. After the after the ways of righteousness. All right. After our Lord. Okay. That's how uh, we ought to carry ourselves to the spirit and power of Yahweh by Hashem All right. Because the Lord supped with us. Okay. Through the spirit. And um. If you're walking in the spirit, we're supposed to walk after his ways. All right? So, our conversation should be uh, 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 holiness, holy and, 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 and godly, set apart and godly. All right? Our conduct should be uh, that of, uh, uh, of the old path, okay, of righteousness. All right? Which is in our, our Lord, Yahweh Shai. Okay, it's, it's, it is him that we look to. Okay, so walk in the light, meaning uh, the knowledge, wisdom, and understanding that you gain through the spirit and power of Yahweh Bashim Shai, applying it. Okay, applying the ways of our Lord. Okay, so um, I've got some scriptures lined up here. All right, and we're going to start in the book of uh, St. John, the eighth chapter. Okay. So, Lord willing, by the end of this lesson, you'll be edified. Okay, this is John, St. John chapter 8, and verse 12. And it reads, Then spake Yahawashai again unto them, saying, I am the light of the world. See? He's our example. He's our model. We, we seeking after the ways of our Lord, Yahawashai. Because he's, he's, he, he's, he's the light, man. Okay? And that's how we have to walk in the light, apply the wisdom, okay, or the scriptures, all right? It says um, the things that you were taught, all right, and the things that the Holy Spirit teaches, all right? Um, it says, then spake Yahweh Shai again unto them, saying, I am the light of the world. He that followeth me shall not walk in darkness, but shall have the light of life, see? He that followeth me shall not walk in darkness, but shall have the light of life. Right. So when you follow after the Lord, that's going to bring you, all right, to the light of life, man. You see? It's going to make you alive. It is the spirit that quickeneth, right? The, the spirit teacheth all things, right? And the Lord sup with you through the spirit, right? Right? So... At the end of the day, you have to walk in the light, man, after the ways of righteousness. Okay? It says, Then spake Yahweh Shai again unto them, saying, I am the light of the world. He that followeth me shall not walk in darkness, but shall have the light of life. Okay? The light of life. Right? So, we're going to go from there. 
we're going to go over to the next chapter, St. John the ninth, the, the ninth chapter, right? And we're going to start reading at verse 4. So St. John chapter 9 and verse 4 says, I must work the works of him that sent me, right? While it is yet day, the night cometh when no man can work. As long as I'm in the world, it says, as long as I am in the world, I am the light of the world. So the light, all right, this light represents Yahweh Shai, man. Okay, he's that light. So you got to walk in the light, walk after the ways of righteousness, walk after our, our, our Lord, man. You have to be of the, uh, uh, of the same mind. You see, you got to be of the same mind. Now the scriptures tell you when you go to Revelation, okay, Revelation, uh, the third chapter and the 20th verse, how the Lord substitute. This is Revelation chapter three and verse 20. It says, behold, I stand at the door and knock. This is red letter, our Lord, Yahweh Shai speaking. If any man hear my voice and open the door, I will come into him and will sup with him and he with me. So the Lord sups with you through the spirit, man. All right. That's how he sups with you, through the Spirit. Now, the Scriptures speaks about us having the mind of a Mashiach. Let's go to that. Uh, this is the book of 1 Corinthians. 1 Corinthians chapter 2. I'll start reading at verse 10. All right, it says, But the Most High had revealed them unto us by his Spirit. There you go. For the Spirit searches all things, yea, the deep things of the Most High, the Heavenly Father whose name is Yahweh. It says, For what man knoweth the things of a man, save the Spirit of a man which is in him? Even so the things of the Most High, Yahweh, knoweth no man but the Spirit of God. Now we have received not the Spirit of the world, but the Spirit which is of the Most High, that we might know the things that are freely given to us of Yahweh, which things also we speak, not in the words which man wisdom teacheth, but which the Holy Spirit teacheth, comparing spiritual things with spiritual. But the natural man receiveth not the things of the Spirit of the Most High, for they are foolishness unto him. Neither can he know them, because they are spiritually discerned. So a man walking after a car the carnal way of life, he can't receive the, the things of the Spirit, because they walk carnally. Right? It says... um. Well, you know, the Lord could pass a message to whom he, to whomsoever he will. Because the scriptures tell you how no man can resist the Lord's will. All right? But if, if you're in a carnal, if you're in a carnal mindset, all right, if, you, if you're a natural man, that means you're not going after the ways of the Spirit. Okay? It says verse 15. But he that is spiritual judges all things, right? Yet he himself is judged of no man. And this is the point, verse 16, it says, For who had known the mind of the Lord, that he may instruct him? But we have the mind of Amashiach. We have the mind of Amashiach, all right? The anointed, our Lord, all right? We have uh, uh, the same mind because we are searching, we are, we are seeking after his ways, okay? That's why we walk in the light because he represents the light, all right? The Lord represents the light, man, Okay? Now, when you go to uh, 1 John, 1 John, uh, 1 John chapter 2, 1 John chapter 2, verse 20, it says, But ye have an unction from the Holy One, and ye know all things. Okay? Meaning an, an anointing. Right? I have not written unto you, verse 21, I have not written unto you because ye know not the truth, but because you because ye know it, and that no lies of the truth. So we just read how the Lord sups with, 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 with those that open the door, man. So you're gonna know, you're gonna know uh, certain things, right? Amos 3 and 7, surely the Lord will do nothing but he reveal his secrets unto his servants, the prophets, because the Lord sups with his men. Okay? Uh Let's get the book of 1 John chapter 1 and verse 7. It says, But if you walk in the light, as he is in the light, right, we have fellowship one with another. And the blood of Yahweh Shai Mashiach, 
His son cleanses us from all sin. See? But if we walk in the light, this is how we, this is how we gotta walk. Walk in the light. But if we walk in the light, as he is in the light, our Lord, he's the light of the world, right? He says, we have fellowship one with another and the blood of Yahweh, of Yahweh Shai Mashiach, his son cleanseth us from all sin. You see? So, we got to walk after the way of righteousness, man. Walk in the light. All right? Applying wisdom. Applying the scriptures. Okay? Seeking after the ways of righteousness. Right? Let's go to the book of uh, Matthew. This is the book of Matthew, the fifth chapter. We're going to jump in here at verse 4. Salakia. Uh... So like it, we're going to jump in there verse 14. It says, Ye are the light of the world. A city that is set on a hill cannot be hid. So it says, Ye are the light of the world. So you got to walk in the light, man. That represents our Lord Yahushai. Okay? The ways, all right, the ways of righteousness. Okay, these scriptures, applying the scriptures. Walking and applying the scriptures, applying what you've learned, man. Right? We're all of one body, right? Under the name of Yahweh Shai. All right? He, it's him who uh, adopted us back to the Heavenly Father. Right? It says, Ye are the light of the world. A city that is set on a hill cannot be hid. Neither do men light a candle and put, a, put it under a bushel, but on a candlestick, and it give it light unto all that are in the house. Verse 16. It's the point. Let your light so shine before men that they may see your good works and glorify your Father which is in heaven. All right? So that's the point. To walk in the light, man. Let your light shine. All right? Let your light shine, man. Uh, 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 use wisdom, man. Apply the scriptures. You see? Uh, from there, we're going to go to First, First Thessalonians, the fifth chapter. All right? First Thessalonians, the fifth chapter, and we're gonna jump in here at verse uh, four. It says, "But ye, brethren, are not in darkness, that that day should overtake you as a thief. Ye are all the children of light. See, so we have to walk in the light. We are the children of light, and the children of the day. We are not of the night nor of darkness. Therefore, let us not sleep as do others, but let us watch and be sober. For they that sleep, sleep in the night." And they that be drunken are drunken in the night. But let us who are of the day be sober, putting on the breastplate of faith and love, and for an helmet the hope of salvation. For the Most High had not appointed us to wrath, but, up to, but to obtain salvation by our Lord, Yahweh Shai Mashiach, who died for us that whether we wake or sleep, we should live together with him. Wherefore, comfort yourselves together and edify one another, even as also ye do. So we are children of the light. So we have to walk in the light, man. We have to walk after the, way of, the ways of righteousness, man. Okay? You see? You have to walk in the way uh, 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 of the light, man. Okay? Uh, we're going to go to the book of... Let's go to the Apocrypha. We're going to get uh, the book of Baruch. Baruch, the fourth chapter. We're going to start at verse 1. It says, This is the book of the commandment of God. All right, the Heavenly Father, whose name is Yahweh, the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. It says, And the law that endured forever, all they that keep it shall come to life, but such as leave it shall die. Turn thee, O Jacob, and take hold of it. Walk in the presence of the light. Walk in the light, all right? Walk in the presence of the light thereof that thou mayest be illuminated, okay? You see? It says, Give not thine honor to another, nor the things that are profitable unto thee to a strange nation. O Israel, happy are we for the things that are pleasing to the Most High, all right? The Heavenly Father, whose name is Yahweh, are made known unto us, right? See, the things that are pleasing to the Most High are made known unto us, man. You see, 
And this is why we have to walk in the light, man, which represents our Lord Yahweh Shai. Because he is that light. Okay? Um, let's get one more. We're going to go to the book of St. John. St. John, the 14th chapter. All right? We're going to start reading at verse 1. And we're going to read down to verse 6. Which is the point. It says... It says, Let not your heart be troubled. Ye believe in the Most High, believe also in me. Right? This, this is a red letter to our Lord. How shall I write? It says, In my Father's house are many mansions. If it were not so, I would have told you. I go to prepare a place for you. And if I go and prepare a place for you, I will come again and receive you unto, me, unto myself. That where I am, there ye may be also. And whither I go ye know, and the way ye know. Okay? Thomas said unto him, Lord, we know not whither thou goest, and how can we know the way? Hawashai said unto him, I am the way. See? <laughs> the Lord is that standard, man. I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh unto the Father but by me. All right, so Yahweh Shai is that way. He represents the light. Okay, we, we have to follow after the, the, the light, man. Okay, you see. So, yeah, man. Uh, I think in the scripture, First Peter says, talk about the bright, uh, uh, the day star arise in your hearts. Uh, I think that's um, Second Peter chapter one. We have a more short word of prophecy, I think. Right. They don't. All right. Uh, Second Peter chapter 1. Uh, the Spirit led me here. This is uh, It says, We have also a more short word of prophecy, whereunto ye do well that ye take heed, as unto a light, all right, that shineth in a dark place. See? Until the day dawn and the day star arise in your hearts. Who is that? That's Yahweh Shai. You see? He's, our, he, he, he's the, the shepherd, man. We follow after him. You know, the scriptures say, uh, 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 we follow the lamb whithersoever he goeth, man. All right? Uh, I think in Revelation it also speaks about. Uh, uh, Revelation 22 uh, It's very fine That scripture Revelation 22 um, Verse 16 it says I Yahweh Shai have sent my angel To testify unto you These things in the churches I am the root and the offspring of David and the bright and morning star, right? What the star does? <clears throat> what does the star do? Gives off light, man. Illuminates. Okay? So we're falling after the light, man, which is Yahweh Shai. Okay, so walk in the light, man. All right? I'm going to end the lesson there, Lord, when you were edified, giving all honor, glory, and praise unto Yahweh. Bashim Yahweh Shai, Bashim Rekakwadash. The be honors to the elders and apostles of great men, stone who taught me the truth and rule well. Salutation and citations to the brothers out there that are laboring and pushing this truth in truth and in sincerity and in charity, risking their lives and the freedom to do so. Until the next time, shalom.